The Federal Executive Council, FEC, has approved the 2020 Finance Bill for subsequent transmission to the National Assembly. The decision was taken at a meeting of the Council presided over by President Muhammad Buhari on Wednesday. Zainab Ahmed, the Minister of Finance and National... Uh, the Minister of Budget and National Planning, briefed State House correspondents at the meeting, at the end of the meeting, uh, saying the bill was meant to support the 2021 fiscal year budget. Ahmed added that through the bill, the federal government was seeking to make incremental changes to tax laws relating to customs and excise, as well as other fiscal laws to support the implementation of annual budgets. In producing this bill, what we were inadvertently doing was amending provisions in 13 different tax laws, which includes company income tax, personal income tax, VAT, and a few others, including the Public Procurement Act and the Fiscal Responsibility Act. Some highlights of these provisions include, one, amendments that we have had to make to provide incremental changes to tax laws. These amendments include providing fiscal relief for corporate taxpayers, for instance, by reducing the applicable minimum tax rate for two consecutive years, so for, from 0.5% to 0.25%. This reform will commence, and it will also be closely followed by the cessation rules for small businesses, as well as Providing, we also made provision to provide an incentive for mass transit by reducing the import duties and the levies for uh, large tractors, for buses, and other motor vehicles. The uh, reason for us is to reduce the cost of transportation, which is a major driver of inflation, especially food inflation. Also at the FEC meeting, the Minister of Works and Housing, Babatunde Fashola, said his ministry has so far completed over 1,700 housing units under its pilot national housing program, which kicked off in 2016. The minister said over 1,000 local contractors have so far participated in the project, which generated lots of employment in the process. A total of... 3,926 housing units across 36 states, out of which 1,786 has been completed and 2,140 are still in various stages of completion, either the buildings, the internal road network, the plumbing, the electrification, and so on and so forth. Um, and to let council know that that project on its own has provided engagement for 1,056 indigenous contractors across the country who in turn not only employ direct staff but also employ labor, artisanal skills, and um, uh, those types of uh, workmen in executing this process, these projects across Nigeria.